Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Nairi Hall. And I'm Audra Fallen. Today is Monday, April 4th, and we're here with your morning announcements. It's almost that time. Juniors, please start submitting ideas for your senior sweatshirt and senior t-shirt designs to COHS Class of 2017 at gmail.com. Current sophomores, you may now begin submitting t-shirt designs for your junior t-shirt. The top t-shirt designs will be pasted on tally space. All designs should be sent to COHS Class of 2018 at gmail.com. Seniors. Vote for the best of 2016, such as Best Dressed, High School Sweethearts, Most Likely Two, etc. Vote now on TallySpace at vote.tallyspace.com slash COHS. Due to conflicting information on the NHS information sheets, applications will be accepted until Monday, April 20th. Applications must be turned into Mrs. Henderson in HP2 or Ms. Johnson in HP6 no later than 3.30 p.m. We're sorry for the confusion. The Ultimate Frisbee Club will be hosting its last four games of the year. Join them on their practice fields from 3.30 to 4.30. They play every other Monday with their next game being scheduled for April 11th. Bring cleats or running shoes, plenty of water, a dark and a white shirt. If you do not know how to throw, they will teach you. It is a very beginner friendly game. Bring a friend and try something new. Check School Loop for more information. It is not too late to join your class's sports arama team. They need you. Freshmen see Mrs. Lassiter, sophomores see Mr. Taylor or Mrs. Clark, Juniors report to Mrs. Anderson, and seniors report to Mr. Robards. And if you're still not sure if you want to join, here's a preview. Let's pass on over to Teresa and Sunny for your weather update. Hey there, Wolfpack. It's time for this week's weather forecast. Monday and Tuesday will be cloudy with the high 70s and low 80s. Wednesday will be sunny in the high 80s. Thursday will be cloudy in the low 80s. And Friday will be raining in the low 70s. Now I'm going to pass it on over to Sunny for the rest of your weather forecast. Thank you, Teresa. Well, later this week, it's supposed to be a little colder here. In the northeast, it's going to be way colder. Winter storm Ursula hit earlier this week with heavy snow falling in New York and over 30 flights being canceled at the Boston Logan Airport. This weather system even postponed the Yankees' home opener against the Astros today. Instead, the game will be played tomorrow afternoon. But sports aside, since that's not my segment, many school districts canceled school today. They were fortunate enough to have a school day or a snow day along with a three-day weekend on the or with along with a three-day weekend. On the contrary, the Massachusetts Turnpike 
which is a 138 mile stretch of highway in the northeast, speed limits were reduced to 40 miles per hour. So try driving in that. Well, that's all the news regarding weather that I have for you this week. Back to you guys, Audra and Nairi. Now let's take a look at what Mr. Wong has for us on Council's Corner. Hi, good morning, Wolfpack. This is Mr. Wong with Counseling Corner. A couple important things coming up. Uh, first of all, this is term four, so we have eight weeks left at the end of this year. It's going fast. Make sure you don't fall behind. Stay up on all your homework, and let's do some extra studying for those tests. All right, seniors, important notice. CRC, if you're looking to attend CRC next year, you have to go through several procedures. And so it's very important that you follow through all the procedures. Currently, we only have 11 students who are fully completed for registration for next year. So it's really important if you plan on attending CRC next year, that you go in to the Career Center and talk to Ms. Warren. If you haven't started the orientation process at all for CRC, we're gonna have a new CRC orientation in two weeks during Wolfpack Hour. So if you're interested in attending CRC, go see Ms. Warren in the Career Center. All right, juniors, next week we're gonna have Junior Parent Night. Uh, it's a great night to get some information regarding your senior year. Also, we're going to have breakout sessions that you can talk to representatives from various different colleges. We're going to have a college representative from CSUS, a college representative from UC, Stanford, UOP, and CRC. In addition, this year we have a special representative, Mr. Conley. He's a professor over at CRC, and he does more of the technology and the construction and some various different hands-on programs that they have there. He's also going to talk about their new $13.2 million building that they just recently built. It's a great building, it's really impressive. Uh, make sure you come next week and find out more information. In addition, juniors, it's really important. If you plan on attending a four-year college straight out of high school, you must take the SAT or ACT. If you're looking to go to a good college, you have to get a good score. So we wanna make sure that you take it at the end of this year and again at, at the beginning of next year. But for SAT, there's only two test dates left. May 7th is the next test date coming up, and the last day to register for the May 7th test is April 8th. The second and last test date for the SAT is going to be June 4th, and the last possible day to register for the June 4th test date will be May 7th. So you can have an option. You can either take the SAT or ACT. Um, there's only one option or one test date available now for the ACT and that's gonna be June 11th. The last day to register for the ACT will be May 6th. So juniors, if you're planning on going to go to a four-year college, you have to do well in the SAT or ACT. It really helps out um, your application and your ability to get into a great college. All right, Wolfpack, let's finish strong. Eight weeks left, keep your grades up. Unity Day applications are out and they will be due by this Friday, April 8th. We strongly encourage you to apply as this is the last one for the school year. This is a reminder that Hype auditions are this week. If you haven't already gotten an audition packet, you can print one from School Loop on Mrs. Hendricks' webpage. Your audition packets and teacher rec recommendation forms are due Monday. See you next week. Wolfpack Performing Arts is looking for responsible volunteers who would like to usher for our upcoming musical Hairspray. If you would like to usher, please go to Ms. Chun's School Loop website to fill out the online interest form and plan to attend a mandatory usher training on Wednesday, April 6th from 3.30 to 4.30. You must be able to commit to ushering at least half of the performances between April 22nd through the 29th. Hey CO, our Pineapple Palooza food fair is just around the corner. On April 15th, the MP room will be transformed into a tropical paradise filled with delicious food, tons of good vibes, and amazing decorations. Hope to see you there. Clubs, make sure you turn in your food fair forms to the black box in the leadership room or to Tara on School Loop. Maybe you recently earned an, a D or an F in a core class. Maybe you would like to earn some extra credit to move you one step closer to graduation. Maybe you just want to be prepared as possible for your upcoming math or AP class. There are so many great reasons to attend the summer class. Last year, CUHS students earned over 2,500 credits during the summer session, and this year we are hoping for even more. If you are interested in attending summer school, please pick up a registration form in Student Services or print one from the school's website and turn it to your counselor. April is Soul Hope Month at Consumers Oaks. We are collecting donations of plastic folders, old denim jeans, black Sharpie markers, 
gallon Ziploc storage bags, and fabric scissors. You can drop them off in the office or in HMTU. There will be six opportunities to cut shoes for children in Uganda whose feet have been treated for jiggers, and the first two are this week. You can earn community service for hours for cutting shoes too. Meet in HM2 this Wednesday, April 6th, or Thursday, April 7th from 3.20 to 4.20 p.m. If you have any questions, go loop Mrs. Winslow. Well, that seems to be all we have for you today. I'm Audra Follin. And I'm Nairi Holmes. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Hug a New Person, Person Day. Day.